Um, a shrink told me once that if I ever find myself in the Amazon and a shaman offers me ayahuasca to drink it. So in uh, January of 2010, that is just what I did. Um, in the Amazon with a shaman, drank the ayahuasca and um, I was able to um, converse with my past lives um, I was able to astro travel and converse with people on the opposite side of the hemisphere. Um, even going as far as to see a, little, a white light in my friend's belly and tell her that she was pregnant. Um, and, um, I was able to communicate with God. Um, I, uh... Although now I'm um, a much more spiritual person, I was raised a, I was raised a Christian, and um, so God presented um, um, itself to me as, uh, as this old white guy sitting up in the clouds with his long white beard, like very cliche, very cliche, but I you know I think it did so to make it easier for me. Um, and uh, I knew that I had to be respectful of his being. I knew that it was, I don't want to say like walking into the principal's office, but it was just like, this is really intense. Like I better not like make a fool out of myself, put my foot in my mouth, um, you know, kind of like nervous laugh, stuff like that. And um, it was like God was um, like just a concentration of this like energy or love that all of us have within us. Um, you know, everybody, every animal, every plant, you know, just a little drop of this life force or this energy or this, you know, white light, you know, call it what you want to call it. Um, but then here was this being who was just, it was like an influx. It was like just, it was like a volcano of, um, of love and light and energy. Very, very, very intense. Um, All-knowing, um, wise, old, um, but at the same time, um, still able to be amused by uh, simple things, by us, by me. Um, God asked me if I wanted to know anything about my future. And I, I said no, because that wouldn't be any fun. And God smirked at me. Um, you know, it's now 2014 and I'm still, you know, figuring out what that smirk means. But God had a lot more depth in it than I could have ever imagined. And um, it was awesome. If you ever find yourself in the Amazon and a shaman offers you ayahuasca, drink it.